Hit me. Shit. Right in the sternum this time, T baby. Shit. What's up, guys? Back my foot's 352 here, and today I'm gonna be bringing you guys a video that I made with just uh, some tips about some basic things that I discovered about the monkey rounds during uh, when you're playing Zombies on Ascension. Um, I've heard a lot of different uh, opinions on the monkey rounds. Some people love them, some people hate them. Um, I, I'm kind of split in between the two. Uh, I'm a fan of them because I just think it's cool that the monkeys steal your perks and everything. And it's, it's a nice new challenge. It's a nice way to mix things up. But there's also some kind of almost like glitches that I really don't really like about it. Um, I kind of think it, it ruins monkeys. One of them is that uh, if you try and jump over a monkey, like say the monkey is coming up the stairs and you're going down the stairs, you can't jump over monkeys at all, no matter how high you are above them. It's like there's this invisible barrier that extends like 10 feet above each one of them. So you can never jump over the monkeys. And I don't know, I find that to be just really annoying and there's really no use for it in the game. Um, I think that's the way that the uh, Nova 6 crawlers were originally in Kino. And I think they, they added a patch that actually made it so you can jump over them. But anyways, on with the video. Um, you'll notice that when monkeys come, uh, everything, uh, like the, everything always, the colors and everything change, the sky changes, uh, so that's how you know that the monkeys are coming, but you probably already knew that. Uh, the monkeys have two main attacks. Uh, they've got a swipe attack, and they've got a pound attack, the one that you just saw right there. And I think I'll show you the swipe attack. Yeah, there's a the swipe attack. The swipe attack, they can hit you a lot faster, but the pound attack, they can hit you a lot further. So, there's the pound attack again. Um, and basically, he just jumps up, pounds the ground, and it does damage to everyone who's in a uh, radius even close to him, really. And if you notice right there, the way that I found how to avoid it is if you're not making contact with the ground, when the zombie hits the ground, it's not going to hurt you. So, right there again. I jumped right before the zombie hit the ground and it didn't do any damage to me. And this is really useful because even when a zombie, say the or monkey, say the monkey is uh, on a staircase, like right there, even if you're on different levels, it's still gonna hurt you when he pounds the ground. So all you gotta do is jump and you'll be fine. Okay, uh, one more thing about monkeys that most people don't know. Uh, if you buy a perk during the monkey round, there aren't going to be any monkeys that spawn to go take that perk. So if you say one of your teammates has perks and uh, the monkey round comes, you can buy as many perks as you want. And unless your teammate has the same perks as you, uh, the monkeys are not going to take them. So any perk that you buy uh, after it's been stolen too. So say you already had Juggernaut and you buy Juggernaut again during the monkey round the monkeys aren't going to turn around and start coming after it again. And one last thing is that uh, once a monkey steals a perk, that monkey doesn't go after any more perks anymore. All it does is go after and try and attack, go after you and try and attack you. But also you notice this monkey right here has not stolen, has not stolen any perks yet, so uh, he's still going to go after us if we get too close to him, but if we get far too far away like I did right there, he's going to turn around, run away from us, and go after uh, the perk that we have, which is Juggernaut. Another thing that I often see people trying to do is uh, have all the teammates buy uh, claymores, and then they use those claymores to set up uh, to try and protect the perk machines that they won't be able to get to during the monkey round. Um, so they hope that their claymore will, uh, their one claymore or multiple claymores will blow up the monkeys when they come and try and attack it. Um, no matter how many claymores you have, this isn't going to work, because as you see right there, Monkeys jump and do their uh, their ground their little ground slam ground pound before they even get in close to the range of the claymore. So monkeys see the claymore, like right here. He sees the claymore, jumps and pounds the ground before he gets even close to the claymore. So it, claymores will never work against monkeys because uh, they just blow them up every time. And you may have known this from the trailer, but if you throw a grenade at a monkey. That's not going to work either because monkeys actually throw grenades back at you. Um, Durst devices, uh, when you throw one of those, the monkeys will jump into it, but it doesn't kill them. It just teleports them to another location around the map. So they're still going to be coming after you. They're still going to be coming after your perks. 
uh, it'll just buy you some time, say, if one of your teammates gets down. And uh, I think that pretty much does it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Remember to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks.